this is all sap, waiting to be cooked. And this is all sap waiting to be cooked. We have a lot of sap waiting for our attention. And uh, yeah, it's a cooler day today. So I'm hoping that we, that will mean that the sap's gonna slow down a little with the trees. Not that I want it to stop, but like, as you can see behind me, we have to cook that all. And we've just had a bumper crop all of a sudden in the last three days. So um, we are gonna spend today cooking, obviously collecting if that's what we need to do. But um, yeah, it's uh, pretty, pretty exciting. It's our first time using this system. I have not used it. Uh, you guys are joining us for the first time. I have no idea how it's gonna work. I mean, I've used this system outside. We've done it for three years outside. Um, but this is, or sorry, two years outside. Um, this is our third year, uh, This, but this system worked outside. So we've just made it for the in indoors. And so uh, I'm just super excited to get going. So I've got a little, just a little contraption. I made it myself. Um, so it's got three channels in here. It flows kind of like this and it goes like that and comes back. And then I've got my tap here where I put my pail underneath when the sap is coming off, then I just open that up and, uh, and then I can just run off the sap. Here's my other one. This is my, my cooling one or my, my warming one. So I just open that, but just have a little trickle on there and I'll show you as I go. So. And then we got a roll going on our on our uh, sap here. Uh, it took a little bit to get it going, uh, to get enough heat going, and to cool, to uh, heat up this whole uh, evaporator. Um, but we've been cooking inside all day. Uh, it's been a miserable day actually outside, but inside here, it's just beautiful, nice and warm. And so this is my first batch that we're working on. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna finish it on uh, propane. So the reason why I finish it on propane is because I can, I can uh, uh, play with the, the, the flame a little bit better than in the evaporator. And so when I'm gonna filter it through, uh, there's the, the felt cloth and then there's a, there's a thicker cloth uh, underneath filter that we're gonna use. So we're gonna filter it all through there, get rid of some of the maple sand and stuff like that that's in there. And then we're gonna cook it down on the pot. Um, and then I use a candy thermometer to, uh, to get it to 219 degrees Fahrenheit. That is 104 degrees Celsius. So, uh, so we're just gonna filter it down now. Okay, now I've got it boiling over here. I've got the top tray that was in uh, that was in here. I've got it down into here, so it was preheated already. And now I'm going to just start on my next one. 